Golf Life visited the PGA Show recently. Let's head inside. Welcome back to our Golfer Approved segment here on the PGA Show floor, and Chris Johnson joins us. Chris, thanks so much for taking the time to go around this show for us. It's, uh, it's been an unbelievable show. I'm really uh, excited to see so many people out. This has been the biggest attendance we've had in years. Got to see a lot of people I haven't seen in a long time. Absolutely, and what we're pumped about is Chris joining us for our Golfer Approved feature now. Chris is the number one ranked putter in the world on competitive putting championships, and there's some real significant ones, like for example, at Putting World, which is a cool place that uh, is a ping uh, facility in Phoenix where they're giving away, what, 30,000 a, a month? Uh, 30,000 30, February 3rd and 4th, and we have a $100,000 putting tournament March 16th and 17th in Scottsdale, right next to TPC. You picked up a nice check at the Pop Stroke yes, Tour sir. Championship. Yes, sir. Been lucky enough to, to be fortunate on Tiger Tiger Woods and TaylorMade co uh, combined to create a tour at Pop Stroke venues and been thankful to, uh, to have that tour over the last year and been able to win and finish number one on their rankings as well as. You went around the show and took a look at the trends in putting yeah. and some of the stuff that's going on. What did you see? in the trends aspect of putting? Well, I'm a big uh, feel guy. So finding the things that aren't gonna make me get in too robotic or too analytical are exactly what I'm looking for. And we found one this week. And what is that? Talk to uh, me that's, about that. That's an integrated part of stack system. So most stack, people okay. know uh, stack as a speed training system. Right. So within that app, they have a putting, only putting, app that can detail every single round you play. It's gonna come back, tell you statistically where you're gaining strokes, where you're losing strokes, and also you're gonna be on a different grade school than I am. You can adjust it to tour level, or you can adjust it to whatever handicap anybody wants to be. You here today may have found a couple of things as well. Absolutely, the putt out, they have created a green that's on a very small a platform of foam that's light and it breaks down and then has a green that's extremely smooth and you have these very small bubbles on the outside of the mat. So if this is the platform, you got little bubbles coming out and you step on the bubbles and that actually inflates one side. It creates some break. So you can create a fully stimulated green just with pressing. And how do you know what the degrees are? How do you? So it correlates with the app. Oh, they you have an app. You can actually put the app on the green and know at the ball, hey, it might be zero and flat. Halfway there, it's a two degree slope oh, left wow. to right. And then up at the hole, it either continues or it straightens out. Just, you can do double breakers, you can do uphill, you can do downhill. And for a price point of $300, oh, wow. I couldn't believe how cheap that is, how accessible that is to the masses. And uh, 30 minutes a day on that thing, yeah, that's tremendous. Well, Chris Johnson, thank you so much. Uh, golfer approved. He's approving a lot of good stuff out there. So uh, you will be back yes, with us sir. in the future with Golfer Approved. But thank you for all the work you did for us here at the PGA Show. So many cool products are launched at the PGA Show, like the new grit from Street Rod Cars. Mike Egling joins us, my old friend from the tour. 43 years on the tour 42 years close enough and you were 40 you're 45 years old correct so you were a toddler on the yes, tour yes yeah. sir yeah he's a tour rep who knows everybody and everything and has seen everything since what 1972 72 yes it's the first pga show at the contemporary hotel so mike what were a couple of the products out there in the launch monitor space that you saw that uh was very interesting to you well flight scope has where you can track your golf ball. Um, yeah, it's on Amiibo. I actually saw that. That was cool. So that they set a phone up behind and they're actually able to take the data from the flight scope and, and overlay your shot on your video while, of course, it's a launch monitor and it's collecting all the other data. That was cool. What, what other uh, launch monitor? Well, the simulators, uh, the one that you can play worldwide golf on. Golf sign? Golf sign, yes. Uh, that was very crowded, had a lot of attention. Uh, it's kind of interesting that you can sort of tee it up and play anybody in the world. Yeah, that was neat. And and in other areas of the of the show, what what I know you worked with some companies and 
got the chance to meet them. What, what companies really stood out for you that were interesting? Well, the, um, we've all been influenced by this in golf as far as range finders. The one that stood out to me is, is Caddy Talk. They're number one in Korea. They're number two in Japan, soon to be number one. They want to come over to the United States market. What makes them so different or their technology is called triangulation, meaning that um, if somebody has a front left pin and there's a back right bunker, you can get those yardages and tell those distances and no one else has that. Plus, it's very small, it fits in your pocket. And the other thing that's great for all of us is it's rechargeable. Yeah, yeah, I think that triangulation thing, go to their website and you can learn a lot about it. It's actually very unique. And, and in any other companies, I know you're, you're a sharp dressed man, so do, what about in the apparel side or yeah. accessories or anything like that? Well, and, and as we all know, there's, uh, there's many here, many to choose from. And Seven Diamonds is a family owned company. They're in their third generation and they've started in 1999. They have over 1,500 SKUs, some really innovative materials, super, super nice people, great product. It'd be fun to go see it. That's a few SKUs. Yes, it is. Well, the tour rep is our golfer approved tour rep, and he's gonna be back with us, but Mike Egling, thank you so much, Thank you, sir. Mike. Appreciate, I appreciate it. your time. Thanks, buddy.